Yeah, um, I'm Sean Warren and I'm the Clinical Services and Support Manager. For the past couple of days we've been holding the National Delivery Team Conference. Workshops have been really exciting, I think there's a real buzz around the workshops and people are learning a lot, picking up a lot, but also just simply talking to each other and sharing their experiences, it's been really good fun. My name's Marie Hill, I'm an optical technician and I'm also a regional trainer. The event about is assisting all of the delivery team to um, give them the best requirements to make sure that they're happy and comfortable in doing their role, finding any Thing that they're a bit unsure about, finding anything that is going to help them, little tips and advice and, and, and things like that. My name is Shazia Khan and I'm a mobile optical technician for the Outside Clinic. I've picked up a lot of information that I don't think we would have got on a normal daily basis, so yeah, it's been really interesting. The first, I think my, my first workshop was really intense, but it was good, it was with Sean, so that's been my best so far. I'm Chantal, I'm the national trainer um, for the delivery team. The workshops are going really, really well. Um, they're all very different, some improving clinical knowledge, some improving practical knowledge. Philippa's workshop on low vision has given us lots of information on how we can advise patients who maybe their glasses aren't, aren't helping in the way that we, they want them to, so that gives them that element as well. My name's Keith Evans, I'm a delivery uh, team member uh, working around Cheshire in the North West. For me, it's the pathological conditions that I've met the most, I've learned the most from. We're actually just putting names to faces. That's the biggest thing for me, so I've got an understanding of who's who. Our workshop is about facimetry and measurement, so kind of linked to aftercares. Everyone's been really positive, um, we've spread out the teams really well, so people are working with people that they've not necessarily met before, and they're getting on really well, so, and at the end of the day, we're doing it for them, so it's nice that they're being really, really positive about it. Hi, I'm Nicole Price, and I'm an optical technician. One of the best workshops today has been uh, pathological conditions with Jen Bass and yeah we've learned quite a lot from there. We don't know the people that we work alongside so to get to see who, who we work with we only see a name on a, on a piece of paper so it's nice to actually put a face to that name and it's, 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 it's been really good. The Optum is a company based in Totnes in Devon run by a gentleman called John Collins who's got visual impairment. We actually provide them with assessment cases which they take out to the domiciliary visits they do and then if they feel that somebody needs some form of magnification that's how they may consider the sort of products that we do. Just enjoyed the serious readers talk. We all enjoy demonstrating the serious readers lamps to our patients but I think that's opened our eyes up to exactly what service they offer. I thought John's um, explanation of the different types of light was really good which means you can go into a little bit more detail with the patient to tell them exactly why the lighting is going to help. <laughs> At Sirius Readers we make uh, high-end task lights, uh, primarily for reading and close work. Our association with uh, Outside Clinic enables them to introduce the lights to their patients, as lighting is one of the things that makes the most difference to patients' uh, comfort of vision. Well, we've got Hoya, we've got Serious Readers, Optima Low Vision has been to see us and they've shown us lots of different magnifiers that are available. Yesterday we had Norville um, come and talk to us, so that's really been quite informative to see the other side of the business. Hoya is a lens manufacturer. Uh, we're working with the outside clinic partly on a supply basis, but also um, to help with education, which is why we've been here today to deliver a lecture on the avoiding non-adaptation with progressive lenses. Best bit has got to be the workshops, actually sitting down with a group of people face to face that we talk to all of the time, getting to know them, getting to know their experiences and actually imparting what we've learned in the office um, to help them out on the road and, and enjoy their roles better. I think all of it has been really, really good, but I'm a bit biased in the fact that I'm actually enjoying our workshop. It's practical, it's hands-on, um, yeah, the facilitatory, never yeah. thought I'd say that. <laughs> we got to have a better look at the insights of, of, of health, ocular health, we don't get to see very often, so... Yeah. Meeting the people, you know, putting faces to names, uh, meeting the managers, yeah, it's a uh, takeaway quite a lot, so it's going to be, it's good. It's finding the people who are not so com confident and comfortable with it and sort of helping them. Um, and also the fact that they're working in teams as well, so they've got friends that can kind of help them. And we've had a lot of newbies as well, so some of those, although we've done training with them, this is giving them just the icing on the cake, just to give them a bit more confidence. Okay.